David here, David Elder Photography, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Crumpler $7 million home. Now, this is a great side bag if you're looking for an event bag where you can get into smaller venues, have a small bag that's going to carry everything that you need. So we're going to go over this quickly so that you can get the information you need to purchase your own Crumpler $7 million home. Now this is the larger size bag on their smaller bags. They have the $1 million to the $7 million homes, each of which as you go up can carry more and more photography instruments. There is the $8 million home which is a much larger bag than this. So keep that in mind, this is the largest of the small size bags. We'll first start with the nylon strap that does come with a removable shoulder pad which is a great enhancing feature because you can take this shoulder pad and place it on any of your other camera gear that you may need. So, and if you just don't like shoulder pads, you can get rid of it. So, great strap. And opening it here, we have Velcro on both sides and down below. Now what I've done to illustrate is that you do have Velcro silencers, so if you're working an event such as a wedding, and you can't be opening Velcro all day, you have a silencer here where no more Velcro attaches. And as you can hear, the Velcro that is there is very sturdy, strong, and quite loud. So what we have here at the top is I've placed my self-timer here in the pouch. It's a great pouch that is easy access. You want to put lightweight articles in here such as memory cards or self-timer. Items that you're not too worried about because this will be on the outside of the bag. Going into the bag, we have an interior compartment on the outside that also has a Velcro mesh line compartment. And this is excellent for placing items such as an iPad directly into the compartment and closing that for easy to carry around your portfolio or whatnot to show your clients. And the main interior compartment is where you're going to have your main DSLR and along with your uh, either second body as I carry or long lens. It depends on what you're carrying but there is quite a depth to this compartment. So, in comparison, I'm going to show you what I can do. I can place my 40D in here on this side, and this is as it came. I picked this bag up yesterday, haven't changed the compartments at all right now. Placing my 50mm, place the kit lens on top of that. I have my Pelican case for my memory cards. I have my flash, I have my flash accessories blower which can go in a side pocket located here on both sides you have a side pocket I'm going to take the extra battery open this main compartment with my iPad place that in with there and then I have my battery grip which goes on my camera that I'm shooting with now so I'll go ahead and place that right here and then I also have a cleaning kit which um, I'll go ahead and place in the front because it's a lightweight item and there you have it. You can place a lot of items in here and I still have room for my main camera with a telephoto lens on it. Um, I don't have a 7200 currently to show you, but I am told that a 7200 will fit in here as well, which is one of the longer telephoto lens that most people carry. Close it and you're ready to go. So this is my review on the Crumpler $7 million home. It's an excellent bag, very durable, and they've added a lot of features such as the Velcro silencer so that you can work your event without being uh, disruptive to your clients. And it's a wonderful bag, great, ready to go, and I think I need years of use out of this. Thank you for watching. Please check out davidelderphotography.com and Go ahead and take a look at my other YouTube links for the other videos I've done on some of the other bags that I carry around with all my photography equipment. Thank you again and have a great day.